In this video, we will discuss about ANCOVA. ANCOVA stands for Analysis of Covariance. ANCOVA is an extinction of ANOVA. Let us take an example and discuss how to do the analysis using SPSS software. See this example, I have three variables. First variable is weight gain, second variable is diet, third variable is age. Weight gain is measurement scale. The measurement scale is scale or continuous data and diet is a nominal measurement type and age is again scale. Using ANOVA, I can find the relationship between weight gain and diet means I have three types of diets are they normal diet, junk diet and health diet. Now the weight gain depends on diet. If I want to know is there any significant difference between the weight gain by the respondent based on the diet, I can use ANOVA test. But if I want to know whether age is covariating, is age as any relationship between the dependent and independent variable, then I must use ANCOVA. In ANCOVA, I have the third variable like age, which is going to covariate the relationship between the dependent variable and the independent variable. Weight is called dependent variable and diet is called independent variable. Here you can see diet is given in kilograms, how much weight is gained and the diet is three type of diet, normal diet, junk diet and health and this is the age of the respondents. Now let us do the procedure how, how we analyze this ANCOVA using SPSS. For this we go for analyze, in analyze we go for general linear model in this univariate. Now dependent variable, weight gain is a dependent variable. Uh, type of diet is fixed variable and age is covariate. Now we have selected weight gain dependent fixed factor as a type of diet and covariate as age. Now click options. In options I want to take a diet and display its mean and I am selecting in display descriptive statistics effect estimates and third one is homogeneity test and you can notice here the significance level is 0 0.05 conference interval or 95 percent. Now click OK. When I click OK, I am in the output screen. You can see here the type of diet 1, 2, 3, number of respondents are 5. So total 15 respondents are there and in each diet we have five respondents and see the descriptives in these descriptives normal diet the weight gain is a 10.76 junk diet 13.44 and health diet 9.8 so basing on the diet the weight gain for junk is more that is 13.44 whereas the health diet people the weight gain is 9.8 kgs now let us go for the third table which is called Levinas test of equality of error variance. In this uh, test of homogeneity of variance we are using Levinas test. If you see the uh, SIG value significant value the significant value is 0 0.087. If the significant value is more than 0 0.05 then the variance is equal across the groups. Now this test of homogeneity of variance is now good because it is more than 0.05 it should be more than 0.05 then only we can go for discussion of the next ANOVA table. Now let us discuss the fourth table this is test of between subject effects. In this table notice the diet. In this diet, if you see this value, significant value, the significant value is 0 0.020, which is less than 0 0.05. If it is less than 0 0.05, it means the age parameter. 
is covariating between the dependent variable and independent variable and we should notice this point if it is less than 0.05 then only the third variable that is age is covariating between the dependent variable and independent variable and you can notice here the r square is 0.722 and adjusted r square is 0.646 it is good the variance is adequately explained by the variables and the fifth table in the output is estimated marginal means you can see the diet is a 10.798, junk is 13.13 and health diet is 10.06. These means are different from the means which we have initially seen. If you see this uh, means, the mean value of health diet is 9.8. But when we, have, when we see this value here, it is 10.06. It means the mean values are adjusted with the age value with age the health diet people are gaining more weight so this is the interpretation we can, we can have with age as age is increasing what happened here yeah, the mean earlier it was only 9.8 but here the mean has increased to 10.06 it means the health diet people also if age increases their weight also will be gained the conclusion part is that the age is covariating between the diet and weight gain. Thank you.